Hey everybody, it's Grady at Twin Creek Audio. Back in the studio today with a special guitar to show you. This is a custom art guitar that was painted by an artist that I'm really close to. And I built this from a kit uh, from Eden Guitars that I bought on Reverb. So it was a Les Paul Jr. double cut style kit. And then the artist painted it like this. This is done with oil paint and brushes and then it was clear coated and then I put a Lawler P90 just a single P90 pickup single volume and tone control and it has black hardware to match the kind of color scheme that the artist decided for this guitar she also decided the black hardware would look best on here so anyway I have some close-ups that I took I even took this outside so you can see this great artwork and paint in the light, in sunlight, as well as in here. And then I've got a little rig set up that I'm going to show you and I'm going to play it for you. So I brought this guitar outside so the lighting would be good enough to look at this incredible paint job. I'm using the camera with a lapel mic because I'm outside the studio right now on the little balcony. So you can see the uh, adjustable wraparound bridge, which I may replace with one of the more vintage style ones. But at the artist that painted this guitar suggestion, all the hardware is black. And it has a Lawler P90 pickup. Those are spec to be about 9.1K, but this one measures it more like 8.9, which is perfectly fine. It sounds beautiful. And this is the back of it. That's a hand-painted guitar. You can see there's a little blemish right there. That was my fault. Played it on several recordings and I used it in a couple of the hot tone demonstration videos to put a graph tech nut on this guitar and it has that synthetic rosewood fingerboard which looks good and feels good but it is strange that this kit that I bought to build this guitar from the neck has these block inlays most Les Paul Juniors are gonna have dot inlays and not these pearl or perloid I guess block inlays And no pit guard on this guitar because of the artwork. I want to be able to see the artwork on the guitar. And here's the back of the headstock. And these are just some inexpensive keystone tuners. I bought these because they were black. This guitar sounds great with a Vox style amp. So I'm going to use my Hot Tone Britwind on channel A, British Invasion channel. And that's how I have it set. So that we can hear this guitar. This is the speaker cabinet. It's a blue Encore 100 instrument microphone. I have it set like that. I actually like to have that mic up a little bit higher, but the stand I've got is kind of short. So it's just mic like this for this demo. And I'm using the PreSonus MP20 mic preamp for my voice mic, which is that channel, and then the guitar amp mic is this channel. P20 dual channel discrete dual servo mic preamp. So here we go with the bridge pickup, which is the only pickup. You can see how when I dig into a chord a little more it breaks up just a little bit. 
So with the same amp settings, if I dig into this guitar, I can get a lot more of a rock and roll kind of sound, or I can, you know, get a little dirtier blues tone out of it. On this guitar, the open strings, the way that they sound, you know, when you play a chord with some open strings, it just rings so nice. Something like this. It's just a cool guitar. I love this thing. It's not perfect. It's the first time that I've ever put together a set neck guitar. So it, it's not perfect, but at least I got the neck angle right where it plays really good. And of course the artwork paint on this guitar is absolutely fantastic. It's just stunning. It's very, very light, which I really love. And I love the way that chords ring out and notes sustain on this guitar and you can get that sustain on a guitar that's not very heavy like this. So I just really love this, and I hope you enjoyed seeing and hearing my special Les Paul Jr. double cut style custom art guitar. It's the second art guitar. Art guitar number one was a Jackson, a pawn shop Jackson that we redid kind of the same way with a blue style paint job. So check out a video I did on that too if you're interested. And thanks so much for watching. I hope you all have an excellent day, night, hour, minute, second, nanosecond, whatever it is you're having. Have a good one. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh-huh, no, but you don't need any. You've had two handfuls of kitty treats already today. And you're sitting on the counter. I can't even get there to wash my hands. I know. You need kitty treats. Okay, I guess I'll see if I can find some kitty treats.